Hey, what is up YouTube? It's Morn here and I'm here with another great video for you guys today. Today we are in front of Dish Destro Uctor. Um, it's this guy right here. He is the vendor or the faction vendor for the snakes. Um, before I show you his castle, I'm going to show you this. It's the elixir shop. So this is a new feature. Um, you can buy that obviously for 25 gold if you want to be a llama. Or not a llama, a camel. But you can also buy these little elixirs. So the golden gold elixir is 5% for 30 minutes, no combat, no PvP for 10,000. Um, these are all flat damage. So this is not percentage, it's flat damage, which is this stat right here. This stat right here. Or not this stat, that's percentage stat. This stat in these boxes below. So that's flat damage. So basically you got plus 50% plus 50% plus 50 all the way through um, the universal ones plus 25 they're all 30 minutes they're all no PvP this one's no combat and no PvP which is kind of weird oh wait no you can't really get gold in combat now can you yeah no that didn't make any sense. okay so let's go ahead and go to the housing shop and we will check out their castle check out their little den Okay, so inside the den, they got cobblestone walls from the look of it. Got like some, um, I don't know what this is, what this is like um, black rock type of stuff, maybe metal. Um, you've got stone in the middle. This looks just like a normal tile floor, like something you'd see in a in a Azteca, to be honest. <clears throat> um, these little things right here kind of look like something you'd see in Aztec as well. This, not so much. This is definitely um, kind of mirage-ish, mirage kind of Middle Eastern. Uh, up here, it appears that the circle things on the roof do stay the same for all of the castles. Um, you got the flags for the Snake Empire, or whatever the uh, snake, whatever you want to call it. Um, it literally just has the head of a snake on there, which is pretty cool. Uh, I guess it's kind of like the uh, palm tree or the shrub tree or whatever it is that was with the Dremel dwelling, um, which was kind of weird because the hoods didn't really. I mean, theirs was kind of theirs was the coolest to be honest, but but I'm not even I'm not exactly sure what it was. While I cannot talk today, guys, I do not know what is going on, but the words will just not come out of my mouth whenever I need them to. Got the arches. All of the designs seem to be pretty much the same. Like the overall. Um, style of the castle is exactly the same. You know, the arches, uh, the shape of the walls, the uh, pattern of the tiles on the floor, the uh, way the roof is designed, it's all the same. Um, yeah, you got the uh, bank in the same place. And supposedly, whenever you actually buy the castle, whenever you teleport to it from here, the cool thing is, if you exit the castle, like if you exit out the store, it will actually take you to um, to the area that, uh, what, what is it, um, god, like, okay, to the area, to the, to where the faction vendor is, holy crap, guys, oh my god, I, I cannot get the words out of my mouth today for the life of me, like, if, if someone had a gun pointed at my head right now and said, you better get the words out of your mouth right now or you're gonna die, I would die because they're not coming out the right way. I'm usually, uh, God, it's terrible. I hate it. Anyways, so yeah, that's that's pretty much it. It exits out to where the vendor is. Uh, so like if this is an Istanboa, you can uh, find this vendor in Istanboa. So for example, if I wanted to, you know, go to this castle, but I needed a quick way to go to Istanboa and I didn't have the tapestry, I could teleport to this castle. And then I could just walk out the door and I'd be in an Istanbul, supposedly. It's kind of like the Arcanum apartment whenever you like teleport to it and you step outside, you end up in the Arcanum. Or the dormitory, whenever you teleport to your dormitory, it takes you, step outside, go to Ravenwood. So, you know. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you did. And I will see you guys next time on my next video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out. Woo! I said the same thing twice on that statement. Wow.